for students the college years are a wonderful time of personal growth, self-discovery, and of course, outlandish pranks. What better antidote to stressful studies than a little jocularity? Like this Indiana undergrad wearing a banana costume to class. The professor doesn't even notice as he continues his lecture. The one of my sometimes we call it Q. But wait, there's more. A pal in a gorilla costume sends Banana Boy peeling out and leaves their peers splitting with laughter. As for the prof, he barely bats an eye at the fruity stunt. The banana chase proves to be a harmless injection of levity into the grind of academia. But some pranks catch innocence in their wacky crossfire. Some of you love music, you love music your whole life. Sam Augustine has no idea his friends have targeted him for hilarity. It was the first Tuesday of the semester, and I was in the history of rock and roll class. He's about to get a lesson on cream, and not the band. They might get D's and F's everywhere else. Is there a clown right now? We're looking out the window, and uh, see, see a guy with huge red hair. Come on in. I was sitting in the front row, and I saw him coming at me. Next thing you know it. Bow. Right to the face. The prankster, Sam's roommate, John, heads for the hills. I was looking for an escape route, and uh, I wanted to make sure I got out of there as, as soon as possible. The pie ambush gets a rousing ovation, as well as some head scratching from lecturer Andy Hollanden. Everybody loved it. And I thought, well, that was quite entertaining. Only then does he spot the female casualty in the second row. And she was covered. Covered with cream, and she was pissed. Fortunately, she gets over her annoyance with no hard feelings. After all, sometimes the best counterpoint to higher education <laughs> is lowbrow humor. Up next, a graduating senior lets it all hang out. Plus, the school bully receives some punishing payback. Then, a pole vaulter hits a new low. On Most Daring, Students Gone Wild.